My name is Mark Batty and I'm the History Subject Advisor. In this video, I'm going to tell you about some of the changes to GCSE history from 2016. As you know, new subject criteria have been produced by the Department for Education for GCSE history. These will apply to new specifications for first teaching in September 2016 and the first examination for the new GCSE will be in summer 2018. The draft specifications will be submitted to Ofqor at the beginning of April 2015 and at this stage we will publish a draft specification on our website. Now we've been giving a lot of thought to what information might be useful to share with you at this point, even though the specification is still very much in development. Firstly, to reiterate, all new GCSE history specifications from 2016 will have to include a thematic study over 1000 years, a period study over 50 years, a study of the historic environment, 40% British history, a British depth study and a non-British depth study from different eras as modern, early modern and medieval. So because it will no longer be possible to study an entirely modern world history course, we don't believe it's necessary to have multiple GCSE history specifications and therefore we'll be offering a single GCSE history specification which includes the most popular topics from the current SHP and Modern World specifications, as well as some engaging new topics. We believe that this will provide the maximum choice and flexibility for teachers to create their own coherent courses. There are already established thematic studies on medicine, crime and warfare in our existing SHP specification, and we will retain these topics in our new GCSE history specification. The new criteria mean you'll have to study some early modern medieval history in depth. We'll be offering a range of early British depth studies including Elizabeth and the Norman Conquest. Edexcel SHP teachers will be pleased to hear that in addition we intend to keep the American West and Weimar Nazi Germany in our new specification. Edexcel Modern World teachers will also be pleased to hear that we intend to keep the Cold War, US civil rights and Russia. We will be offering more topic choices, including some which are brand new to GCSE history, and we'll be letting you know about these over the coming weeks. I'm now able to provide you with the full choice of modern, wider world depth studies that will be on offer in our new GCSE history specification. These will be Germany 1918 to 1939, Russia 1917 to 1941, the USA 1954 to 75 and Mao's China 1945 to 76. We think that most of our SHP and modern world history teachers will be happy with this choice of modern depth topics and with such big changes being forced upon all history teachers by the new content requirements some continuity of topics is important. If you're worried about your GCSE options evenings or about how new A-level courses might fit in with the new GCSE and you want to speak to someone in our history team about our proposed choices in more detail, please email me at teachinghistory@pearson.com or call us on 0844 576 0034.